Hey guys, it's Celeste with Lazy GX Ranch. Um, so today I'm filming way in advance, but I've got a really busy next couple of weeks and I don't want to miss a video. So I just decided to go ahead and plan it earlier. earlier. You'll have to forgive the lighting. Um, I had already planned out how I was going to do the videos. Um, and I was trying to figure out when I was going to have time to actually film the videos. And it's just going to be really crazy. And I just, there was maybe some times I could have squoze it in. But um, anyways, I was like basically coming to the point where it's like I either have to film the videos way in advance or possibly take the chance of not having any videos to give you guys. The planning would still probably get done, it's just the videotaping wouldn't get done. So, well, the not the planning probably, but the planning would get done. The stickers would get laid down, just whether or not I would film it, that's a totally different story. So anyways, I just figured I would just hurry and get it over with and done. And then I don't have to worry about it, I don't have to sit there and stress um, about it. So today we're going to be planning in my horizontal planner, which is a journal. It is a journal for me. And so I'm not going to overly decorate it. If you want an overly decorated horizontal planner, there are plenty of planner babes that use the horizontal as their catch-all planner. Um, I just, I did that once. It didn't quite work for me. So, um... The dashboard is what works really good as a catch-all for me. Um, so if you're looking for like a functional, um, how to turn the horizontal into a catch-all planner, this is not the video for you. Um, but I do kind of want to have just a little bit of joy to my journal, if that makes sense. Even though I use the Pastel Dreams um, horizontal layout, which it's already so much it's, it's a happy planner, <laughs> but, um, I do like to add the stickers to kind of add just that much more joy. Um, so I do Franken plan slash transformer plan. Franken plan means that you have multiple planners all put onto the same disc. Transformer planner means that I use the covers um, of the planners to divide my sections, if that makes sense. So I have my catch-all planner here, and this is my work planner here. Um, and then this is my budget planner here, and then my wellness planner. And the thing I like about doing it this way because as you can see, if I'm in frame, as you can see, there isn't any distractions. That's what I love about using the covers as a divider because the go the cover sticks beyond the paper and so, and even almost above your labels. So there's no distractions whatsoever. And I have ADD, so <laughs> this is really great for me. This really helps me to stay on task because I can focus on just one thing at a time. It's easy to find where I'm at. Like I can just be completely closed, flip right to my wellness section. So this is my wellness section. It's actually comprised of three different planners, um, plus note papers and stuff like that. I just have a little divider. This was out of, um, either the Wild and Free Happy Notes or the Boho Dreams Happy Notes. Um, it just says, I want flowers in my hair, peace in my soul, and love in my heart. And I just used a colorful box to write journaling on there. This is my vision board. I just made it out of a dashboard and actually covered it in contact paper. That's all I did. Um, this is my Catherine Ponder's Prosperity Decree Sheet. Um, and this is just a really good paper. And once again, I just use contact paper to laminate it. Um, I do have a laminator now, but when I first made this, I didn't. Um, but I just, I, I refer to this when I'm having a bad day. 
when I'm feeling kind of down, it's really nice to go to that. So the first planner I have in my wellness section is the Be Well Planner. And it's a healthy hero layout. And it just says intention, nourish, movement, and take note. Um, and then the second planner I have is my Stargazer. Um, and basically, I'm using this to just kind of jot down thoughts. That's kind of what I'm doing here. Like, um, the way my brain works is there's constantly like, why? Why? Why is it like this? Why is it like that? Anyways, so I just kind of write them down here instead of cluttering up my daily journal with them. Um, and then here I'm just, I'm, I, it started out as just affirmations, but as I'm reading or sometimes I'll think of a scripture um, that really sticks out to me and really a lot of the, the um, scriptures in the Bible and all that stuff, they are very much affirmations. So I, I have been kind of writing down some scriptures if it really sticks out to me as I'm reading and it's really important to me and it is kind of like the, you know, this one says, my God is mightier than all the earth. So wherefore, how can I doubt him in such a seemingly small thing? You know, um, and that's actually out of the Book of Mormon. It's not out of the Bible. It's out of the Book of Mormon. It's First Nephi chapter 4. Um, but then today, this was today's, I just said, I earn more than enough money to spare and share. And that's actually um, one of Catherine Ponder's um, affirmations, I guess. Off of her prosperity decree sheets. Um Anyways, and then after my stargazer, um, I have my pastel dreams, which this is the planner we're going to be planning in today. Um, I need to put my name in it, but I haven't. <laughs> so in my quarter at a glance, some people call it a year at a glance, but I call it a quarter at a glance because really all you can see is the quarter at a time. Um, I... Basically, I split the um, days up in two, and I have an a.m. and a p.m. So I'm just writing down um, my mood in the morning and at night, because sometimes my mood in the morning is completely different than my mood at night. Um, so this is the first cover for the Pastel Dreams. Um, my monthly section, I'm just kind of writing down um, things that I love. And then I, I'm writing in this throughout the day, if that makes sense. This was my first week, so I didn't decorate it. I wanted to see how I felt about it. Um, but this one I did decorate, but I still felt like I had plenty of room. Um, and I added the Cultivate Tracker out of the um, Encouragement Sticker Book. I think is what it is, which I've got to find, um, cause I do want to put in another one just like those. Cause it's been kind of nice to kind of, okay. So we have that out. So, um, yeah, I want to say I stole these out of my quotes, my happy quotes or the gold star quotes can't remember which one I had the, those out of. Um, and this is actually next week's. Um, and I added the Cultivate Tracker again. Um, but this is the reason I'm planning so far in advance. I have my brother's birthday here. I have my daughter's birthday here. She's turning 13. She's going to have a bunch of friends over here um, for a birthday party. So I have that going on plus the birthday and then this is my sister's birthday and then this is charlie's birthday <laughs> so and she's turning four so i've got a lot on my plate coming in the next little while and so i just wanted to make sure i got these videos done um so this is the spread for january 20th through the 26th and 
<laughs> I can't sit on my chair because my cat's asleep on the chair and he gets all offended when I make him move. <laughs> so this is the Gold Star Quotes sticker book and it's really, really cute, but I think I want to start with my Cultivate sticker. Okay, which one do you think we should... That one is a really, really pretty one. I might have to get another one of these sticker books. Darn it, darn it. <laughs> you just say, sorry, honey, I had to get another one. Okay, so I have my Cultivate sticker down, so I don't have to worry about forgetting it now. So, this just has a lot of really cute quotes. Yeah, I like that one. You'll have to ignore the scanner. My husband is a police officer. <laughs> and so I just keep it on so I know what he's, you know, up to. I know he's safe. He's okay. I could do that one. I could do it in this planner where I probably wouldn't do it in any of my other ones. Oh, no. Bad sticker. Bad sticker. Panic. I'm panicking, I'm panicking, I'm panicking. <laughs> it got a little excited. Sorry about that. <laughs> it was like, woohoo, a page. <laughs> it thought it wasn't going to get used. Oh, and it's so crooked. Ah! <laughs> Oh well, <laughs> we're just going to let it be who it is right there. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> oh. But anyways, I, I thought it was kind of cute because it's the ombre. So it goes from like an orange to a, like a red. That's funny. It's like so crooked. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Sometimes you just have to laugh. one's going to stick way up. So that one just says living for the weekend. Mm. <clears throat> oh yay. I should. Even though there is kind of already um, so this is my daughter's birthday here, but she's going to have all of her friends over on Friday and we're going to make homemade pizzas, um, because both my husband and I, um, are actually really good at making homemade bread and dough. Um, but he does his completely different than mine. 
I have a recipe and I stick to that recipe. <laughs> and I never ever waver from that recipe. And him, he never makes it the same way twice. Never, ever, ever. And so anyways, we make the dough for the pizza from scratch. And then we just add, you know, whatever sauce we want and whatever toppings we want and cheese. But anyways, so she's going to have a bunch of friends over and she wanted to make homemade pizzas. So that's what's going on on Friday. So this let's party. Well, it's party. Well, we're just going to leave it there. I was thinking I should have put it right there. Why didn't I put it right there? I don't know. Mm. But anyways, so yeah, she's having a bunch of friends over on that day. So that's a good one for that one. That one is not colorful enough, I decided. Okay. If I can pull this sticker up. I think this is the perfect Monday sticker. Cleverly disguised as an adult. Mm. Yo, I like that one. I've never noticed that one before. We're going to have to add it. Is better make it oops than a what if. That would probably be better in my work planner, but, or even in my social media planner. But we have to use it. So I love. Quotes. Quotes are kind of my favorite thing in the whole wireless world, especially when it comes to planning. So whenever I can use a quote, I will. Let's see, this every moment matters. I could put it here. I could move it up here. Why don't we do that? Okay. So now we can add some things here. Um, These are kind of more seasonal. Oh yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, I thought the rainbow in this planner would kind of bother me. But I'm kind of digging it. Because it's more of like a pastel rainbow. It's not like. But this one says. If nothing is certain. Everything is possible. Everything is possible. Like hello. That's just awesome. I love it. <sighs> Don't you just love it. When you throw together a, a layout. And it's just like a spread. Or whatever you want to call it. And it's just. Just speaks to you. I love this. Love it. Love it. Love it. 
And as you can see, I still have plenty of room to write. Um, yeah, so I still have plenty of room to write. So you'll notice some of these, um, I have different colored pens because literally I was just writing with whatever pen was in um, my hand at the time. <laughs> and yeah, I just am writing down whatever's in my heart whenever it appears. So that's how I'm using this planner. Um, sorry, the scanner's being loud again. And then at the very end, I have my, um, oh, making a mark. My safety pin is making a mark. It doesn't need to be there anyway, so we'll just make it go away. Um, and then I have my face planner in here. I don't do plan with me's in this planner. So I know I've had a lot of people asking me about doing an after the pen thing. Um, but yeah, it's just, so I'm kind of doing it right now. <laughs> so this is my faith planner. This was the first week and um, we are following, I don't have it with me because I do it in the other room, but we're following a program called Come Follow Me. And this year we are studying the Book of Mormon because I am Mormon. Um, well, we we actually don't call ourselves Mormons. We call ourselves a member. I am a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints. That is the official name of our church. We are not the Mormon Church. <laughs> um, anyways, um, just the Book of Mormon is another testament of Jesus Christ. It's basically. Um, the people who left Jerusalem, they took the scriptures with them and they taught the scriptures to their kids and their kids taught it to their kids, their kids taught it to their kids. And they recorded their testimonies um, generation after generation. And so it's basically another testimony of Jesus Christ. Um, so anyways, we are studying the Book of Mormon this year and... Um, so I, I have it broken down to um, a scripture a day. Sometimes I'm reading a whole chapter and sometimes it's going to be like just verses in a chapter. So like right here, you'll see that. And so it's written down. It's all scheduled out for the whole entire year. Um, so I'll just write down the scripture here. I read through the chapter, whatever sticks out to me, I'm going to write it right here. And then I take these that I wrote here and I break it down into what I think it's trying to say. And then um, down here, it's how am I going to apply this to my life? So, and then any like footnote scriptures that come that are connected with any of these scriptures, um, I don't have enough room to write it here, so I'll write it here. Um, anyways, and just as you can see, I'm writing little notes everywhere pretty much, but this layout has just been a huge game changer for me. Um, I did it last year in my Faith Warrior um, Planner. We were studying the New Testament and oh my gosh, it was just like a whole new uh, door has been opened to my understanding of the scriptures and um, developing a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. And uh, it just, it, I, I'm, I love this planner. <laughs> I love this planner. So anyways, that's my um, horizontal layout. Sorry you had the faith stuff thrown in there too, but, um, anyways, so that's my, um, horizontal layout for January 20th. I can't remember the dates. <laughs> my mind's drawing a blank. Um, It's January 20th through the 26th. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. 
Um, thank you so much for joining me. <laughs> um, if you liked this video, please consider um, giving me a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell so that you don't miss any future videos. So anyways, thank you guys so much and we will talk to you later. Bye.